Hello everyone! Welcome back to some more Sei Narukano with me, Phantom Zawai. When we last left off, we had finally left the future world, and we were headed towards the world where, presumably, Zetsu's actually waiting for us this time. However, looks like we're stuck in some kind of nightmare. We also know that the Lightbringers are still following us as well, so... Ain't over yet. Here we go. I feel like I'm a kid again. My legs are stuck fast to the ground, like I'm ankle-deep in mud. Or like when I was buried in snow and couldn't get out no matter how much I struggled. I can't move at all. There's something all around me, but the world is pitch black. The only sensation is my nausea, growing stronger and stronger. <clears throat> the ringing in my ears becomes deafening. My entire body is wrapped in a sickening sweat. <clears throat> Someone's looking at me. Someone's calling me. I can't see them. Sorry, but I know they're laughing at me. I struggle desperately to move as he gets closer, sneering at my helplessness. Stay away. Stay away. I don't want him, but my body needs him. The conflict within myself is driving me mad. Stop. Get away. Stay away. He's right in front of me, but he's looking down. I can't see his face, only his eyes. There's nothing in them. No anger, no joy, no sadness, no pain. I just want him gone. I feel sick. I hurt. Tears pour down my face, and my stomach heaves. Who are you? My trembling stops. He looks up. He's... You can just keep your mouth shut, you know? I drill my knuckles into both sides of her forehead. It wasn't. <laughs> Whatever. Huh? Oh no. It wasn't like that. <laughs> I suddenly feel like I'm about to throw up, but I swallow it down again. I wince at the disgusting taste of it. The pounding of my heart is growing louder and louder in my ears. Soon, I can't hear Reimei at all. <laughs> it's that voice from my dream. I practically jump in surprise, but there's nobody else here. Just Reimei and me. <laughs> He keeps whispering. Who? Who are you? I ask inside my mind. Is this a dream? Did I not wake up? I can't tell. No, you're wrong. I'm Satoki Nozomu. I'm not you. I don't want power for anything. I don't need power. Oh, 
殺すのだろうこんな風に Zetsu appears vividly in my mind. I swing my swords at him. Stop! Stop it! That's not what I want! Shut up! No, Zetsu and I. When this is over, one of us will die. Maybe both. Is that the end? Shut up! Just shut up! I tremble at the sound of my own voice. Everything turns bright again, and reality comes rushing back. I can't hear that horrible ringing or the pounding of my heart anymore. I fight to catch my breath, but it's still just Raimi and me here. I'm sorry. Could you let me be by myself for a while? Yeah, alright. I do want something to drink. Remy proudly sticks out her chest and goes floating over to grab a, gla a glass off my desk. Shut up. I'm so sorry that I'm weak. I smile at her whining despite myself. I know she's just trying to cheer me up. It's probably all she can think of to say right now. <laughs> yeah, I can count on you. Remy, don't tell anyone about me. Thanks. She looks at me blankly for a second, then smiles from ear to ear. What? What are you talking about? Just leave already. She carries the off the glass. Let me try that again. She carries off the glass, floating a little, precariously as she goes. <sighs> My head spins again. Ever since I took apostasy, I keep hearing that voice. And now I'm... I'm becoming Jirol? I'm Satoki Nozomu? Or am I Jirol? Will I be okay if I meet Zetsu like this? Will I be able to bring him back? Remy unsteadily floats through the hallway, carrying a full glass of water. She's being very careful not to spill <clears throat> excuse me, not to spill any, so she's moving slowly. She's also been talking to herself as she leisurely flies back to the room. Remy looks up by chance and sees something unusual. レメですか変な顔でもしていましたか泣きそうな顔だったなそうですかどうしたのだ本当に様子がおかしいぞ私もいろいろと考えることがありますのであなたのように何も考えずにマスターといるわけではないので
何か用なのですか私に声をかける暇はないと思いますけどその水彼に持っていくものではないのですかそれはそうだが<笑>変わらないですねあなたはジルオルの転生体はあんなにも弱いのに何だと貴様望むをバカにするな今はあんなでも望むは強く優しいやつなのだぞすぐに貴様の主よりも強くなるのだそうですかその時に彼があなたが慕う瀬時望むのままなのかわからないですけどねどういう意味ださあそれをあなたに教える義務はありませんのでうぐうぐうぐ肝心なことを言おうとしないから腹が立つのだ大体いい何時こそ主を放っておいてもよいのかそうやって無言で済ましてる割には心配そうに見えるな本当は暁のもとへすぐにでも戻りたいのだろうあの方は私がいなくても十分に強い方ですからねすぐに戻る必要はないのですよそう言ってもあまり納得してるようには見えんな我なら用件が済めばすぐにでも戻るものだぞ<笑>よくそんなことを言えますね今瀬時は苦しんでいるのではないですかそれはなのにあなたはこんな場所でのんびり話などしていて今頃瀬時はどうなっているのでしょうねえ<笑>望むなら前世のジロールにも負けたりはしないぞそうでしょうかあなたが思っている以上に前世の影響は彼に出ていると思いますけどえー、うるさい人がせっかく声をかけてやったというのにまったく待ってください一つだけ質問がありますんなんだ今向かっている世界でマスターが待っていますですが本当に瀬戸キはマスターと戦うのでしょうか今ならまだ引き返すこともできると思いますがなんだそのようなことか動き出したらこの連中は止まらんそれに望むは暁を絶対に見捨てないぞ友達だからですかそうだ特に望むにとって暁は最も親しい友だからなさらに言えばいろいろと聞きたいこともあるだから絶対に追いかけるぞ暁がどこに行こうともなそうですか質問は以上です引き止めてすみませんうんではなあそうそう変なことはしようと思うなよおとなしくしていますよあとはあなた方についていくだけですからふん<笑>レイメ
ルちゃんってそんなに寝相悪かったっけ Yeah, it's torture. I wish she just kicked me, but she followed it up with a heel drop too. Just play along. You don't want them to know I jumped out of bed and could barely take it, do you? I should probably put on more of a whispering voice for that, but hey! Why do you ask? I There's no way that I can kill him, but I do know that there's more to it than just that. Whatever he's doing, if it's something bad, then I have to stop him. That's what I think. Yeah, thanks. <笑>ここに来るまでにも赤月くんのことを心配してばっかりなんだよ。いや。Well, <laughs> what do you think he's up to? Whatever he's up to, I'm going to stop him. But back then, he looked deadly serious. So, Man, just shut up already. Huh? Satsuki? Nozomi? What are you glaring at me for? Oh, man. Well, he did pick me, or rather, he did help me pick out a ring, I guess I should say. Ignore the fact that that's for Nozomi. What are you two thinking? Knock it off already. I look out the window, fed up with their nonsense. We're almost to the world that Zetsu's in. Will he answer all my questions there? What? Did you really need to ask me that so nervously? She continues the farce too. But the mood is lighter in here now thanks to the two. No, three of them? You know, I've had just about enough of all of you. I probably should have put a little more emphasis on that line too, hey, you know. I grimace, but we continue chatting and joking around for a little while longer. Oh, minions! Yeah, 
Zetsu shows no surprise as the minions appear, one after another. He stands impassively, like he's been waiting for them. They're attacking Zetsu. He drops into a stance with his sword gleaming. He gathers his strength and calms his breath. ここは貴様たちが足を踏み入れていい場所ではないのだから。さつきのやつめ、自分で持ってきたお菓子のゴミぐらいは自分で片付けろと言ったのに。今度は何時からも言ってやってくれ。ゴミは自分で片付けろと
She mutters quietly to herself, but then her eyes change. The sadness is still there, but there's something far deadlier under the surface. Once all of their ashes have been scattered to the wind, her usual expression returns. She continues to stare off into the, dis the distance without saying anything else. もうすぐ到着だし。そろそろ気合い入れていかないとね。はい。頑張ろうね。望む複雑な心境というやつなのじゃが。まあ、とりあえず奴の言い分を聞きたいからな。その、えっと、えっと、のぞむさんが頑張るんですし、私も頑張りますね。マリアガルヌもいいけど、みんな注意することが一つあるから
Naya tilts her head to the side in curiosity and is about to say something, but then malice suddenly washes over us. Stay on guard! The guy who attacked us has to be here somewhere! For a second, I wonder if it's Setsu, but then a deep voice takes me by surprise. The air is still rippling around his spear from his attack. All of us stare at him in shock. The one who's waiting for us is a member of the Lightbringers, Verbal Zerd. Like we're uh, just going to do what you want. Sorry, but I've got something I need to do too. If you're going to get in my way, I'm taking you out. We can't lose now that Zetsu's in arm's reach. Everyone, please help me. Yeah. We raise our weapons and get ready to fight. They do the same. But Nanashi suddenly floats out between us and begins to slowly disappear. Huh? Nanashi, what's that mean? She fades into nothingness before I can say anything else. I'm worried about what she said, but I have to concentrate on the enemies right in front of me. If I lose here, then there's no way I can stop Zetsu. Remy, we're taking them out. Got it? Nozomu is awakened to a new Riklam name. Max HP, combat mana leveled up. Reptuna, strength and max HP. Naya, max HP and combat mana. Okay, and we got a battlefield. I actually thought we were going to go automatically into a fight there. Uh, you know, probably against Burbelzer, but no. Looks like we are beginning a, uh, a new quote-unquote war, a war map. Very desolate war, war map. There's not much to see out here. Defeat the Lightbringers. War in a Dead World. Chapter 6. Alright, so capture Uijas, or Uijas? Not sure if the J is supposed to be pronounced. Uh, can't lose the town we're currently in, or have all units defeated. Oh, wow. Wow. That's wild. Okay, so there's only one spot uh, through the entire desert to, uh, to basically use as a base. Okay, well, I guess we're going to be probably coming to and fro a lot then. Because uh, you guys know I, I do rely a lot on that HP region and stuff. 
回復することができんかなり厳しい戦いになるぞだがあやつらを倒せば分子世界に危害を加える者も,もいなくなるはず望む全力で進もうゼスとあの粉まいきなナナシに今までの文句を言うためにもな Alright. Organize units. Okay. Um, I mean, it really depends on what's waiting for us along the map as to、uh, kind of how I'd want to sort this anyway. We do have Subaru now. Hmm. Let's take a look at Subaru's skills. Okay. All material damage. Oh, wait, no, he has a force attack here. Um, interesting. Dimension twist. Spell all setup skills. Interesting. Anti interrupt and anti banish. Wow. That is quite interesting. Okay.、A、mana link. And concentration, which is endurance and up and magic down. Okay. Interesting. Interesting. Um, how do I want to sort this though? I could make him an all rounder. Really, I think I probably just should get rid of the Crists. Just because it's another squad, which. At this point in the game, the Chris are not very strong. I mean, granted, like, their level is actually pretty decent at this point, and I can make use of them in rare circumstances, but in general, like, I'm only using them to mop things up, so it kind of feels like a waste to even, like, just have another unit to stand by all the time, you know? Hopefully, you guys understand my reasoning for that. Uh, another thing I could do is I could take another of the really powerful units, Nozomu or Euphoria, and I could have them be an all rounder.、Uh, I'm not sure exactly if Subaru is necessarily up to the task compared to those two. I mean, he doesn't seem bad, but he also doesn't seem as strong. He's got a lot of HP, though. I'll give him that. Hmm. I think for now we have Subaru play an all rounder, and、uh, if we want to, you know, we can,、uh, we can mix things up. But for now, I think this is fine to start the mission at least. Alright, let's go ahead and、uh, begin the mission. But, of course, before we really get into things, I am going to go ahead and end today's episode here. So, as always, if you guys are enjoying the game, I do highly encourage you to pick up the game for yourself. Thanks for watching. I'll see y'all next time.